this is what we use for external beam radiotherapy for prostate cancer. Um, this can form part of the primary therapy of patients. It can be used in combination with other therapies for primary prostate cancer. We also use it for um, palliative treatment. So if, they, if you have painful bone metastasis or, or disease spread to the bone, it helps a lot for pain control in that sense. In essence, it's high energy x-rays. Uh, anything between the 6 and 15 megavolt x-rays that we use. That's produced in this machine. There's a head um, with a um, collimator that can collimate the beam as it exits the, the, the machine. So the direction of the beam can be downwards. Around the isocenter, this machine can then turn around this isocenter and treat from different angles. Um, the, the process is very simple. The patient lies on the bed, they're positioned, and they would be treated. The planning beforehand takes some time. Um, we need to localize the prostate, we need to plan how to get there, we need, need to plan how to shape the, the beams, which angles to come in, uh, and so forth. But once we've done that, the treatment itself is relatively simple. The radical course of radiation can take anything from six to seven and a half weeks of daily treatment, Mondays to Fridays, and it takes approximately 15 to 20 minutes per day. The process is very simple. We have our patient, and the patient needs to lie in bed. The radiotherapist would then position the patient in the correct position. And I don't know if you can notice, but there are um, laser beams coming from different angles that we can use on the patient to do the setup in the same position each day. The patient would then be set up like this, with the beam aimed at the prostate. The radiotherapists, once they're happy that the patients are in the correct position, would leave the room. The field that we treat can be verified, so there's an x-ray panel at the back of the machine that can be used to verify the treatment itself. It's this panel that shifts in below the patient here. So this is like a normal x-ray panel and we can verify that the beam that we're treating correlates with what we plan. Once we're happy with that, we can start the treatment. The radiotherapists will leave the room. The the machine is operated from the outside, the beams switched on, might be anything from one to two minutes per beam. Once the beam is done, the machine head will rotate around the patient to a different angle, and the same process happens again until all the fields are treated. It could be anything from four, five, six fields that we normally do for a um, radical prostate. If it's more palliative treatment, the treatment planning becomes much less um, involved and it might just be one or two beams that we use. The patient doesn't feel anything. It's like having normal x-rays done, so there's no pain involved, no discomfort, a little bit of a noise that the machine makes in the background, but that's the only thing that the patient will notice. Once that's done, the radiotherapist will come back into the room and take the patient off the bed again. And this process repeats itself every day for six to seven weeks.